Now, no man should feel comfortable hugging my girl in front of me like this. This reminds me of when um, Amari Harrick hugged uh, Beyonce and kissed her on the cheek and Jay-Z was right there. Knowing Jay-Z is a jealous ass nigga. Now, this right here looks like straight up and down hating like, nigga, you don't deserve her. You know what I'm saying? Like, but you never holler at her when she was single. Like, you was nowhere on sight. Like, this is just very distasteful. And I would definitely have a conversation if this was my girl. You know what I'm saying? But this is this is just total disrespect. And the fact that you didn't acknowledge him shows even more disrespect. Like, Pretty much, um, they're gonna have a conversation. This is probably gonna come back and bite her in the ass. It's definitely gonna come back and bite her. Whenever they have an argument or something like that, you disrespect this man out here publicly like that. And the, the sheer fact that he didn't acknowledge Jonathan Majors, like, that's just very distasteful, very disrespectful. And, um, yeah, this is not going to go down well for her. If it don't come back and bite her now in the ass, it's going to come back at some point in time or the other. You see, you know, you know it's how he helped everybody, acknowledge everybody, and he didn't acknowledge this man. Like, yo, straight up on uh, disrespect. And this man is very, very uncomfortable very uncomfortable and i could see why black people don't like to see other black people happy even women too yeah i just don't want to see people happy like megan good was single all this time you was never nowhere around anything of the sort like what kind of friendship is this this will definitely raise some eyebrows like come on now this this is this is not it this is definitely not it like he didn't even see this guy it's not like he was out here beating on chicks and shit like that but like yo you're not happy for that man. You're not happy. You're just, you're just a freaking hater. Like, that's just very, very distasteful. Very, di very distasteful. I would have definitely had a conversation with Megan Good. See, he looked at him. He looked past him. I would have probably rocked this nigga, yo. But then now, with this situation, with his career, that wouldn't look good on him. But I would have definitely pull up on this nigga and be like, yo, my dude, don't ever try to violate me like that again. Real talk. Definitely gonna have a conversation, make it good for this one.